everybody. This is Debbie from Home at Serenity Springs and today I wanted to show y'all some footage of some rascally squirrels that we have that started out as just one squirrel that we called Stretch and the bird feeder that you can see in the back, the red one that looks like a mini house he would sit on the branch and stretch his paws out and you'll see some footage of that and eat all of our bird seed and my husband is a lover not a fighter so he's not one that would just shoot them or whatever to keep them away from our bird feeders so we came up with uh, solution number two which was by a squirrel buster bird feeder which is the front one that you can see it's in our rose bed and I actually highly recommend it because it's working really well and I'll put a link for that in the description so that if you have the same problems you can get one this is the smaller one and eventually we'll get the bigger one but it was a little pricier so we haven't gotten that one yet but you'll see that when the squirrel gets to the top of the feeder, it shuts down and makes him unable to get the food. And that's the only way that he can get to it because he can't stretch off from the pole and get to it that way. So he has to come up from the top. And every time he hits the lid, it closes and prevents him from getting the food. So it's really worked well. But I have some interesting footage because they have been very, repeat, very determined to get into this food. And my husband continues to put food in the back feeder for them as well. So they are getting, still getting a source of food. But they cannot figure out how to get into this one. But they sure try. So here's, here's some footage. So of the few clips that I've included... There are probably a hundred attempts that I didn't get video footage of, including one in which he tipped the entire pole over. I thought he had broken our feeder, but it survived the crash. I really wish I had gotten that one on video, but I was too slow. But he is just, he knows he can figure it out if he just tries hard enough. But he hasn't yet, thank goodness. He just knows there's a way into this if he just thinks about it hard enough. You're about to see the lid go down. Every time he hits the top of it, it goes down right there. On this clip, you can see Stretch in the background with his friend on that bird feeder as he's trying to figure out this bird feeder. 
This clip shows our red-headed woodpecker that loves to come and eat. And it has the small birds that prefer our new squirrel busting bird feeder and Mr. Stretch, of course, in the background raiding that bird feeder. This is a much better clip of Stretch doing his shenanigans. This is the last clip. I hope you guys have enjoyed my video. We love to sit on the couch and look out the window and this is our view. And I can't think of a better view to have. Y'all have a good day.